Another high speed chase overnight that ended with three people in the hospital right now. This one started in Sand Springs, but Fox 23's Jenny Young is along Highway 412 where police say it ended. Yeah, Ron, it ended right here where TPD is still working. You can see them out here. They have traffic blocked for just a couple of hundred yards after that driver, like you said, going 120 miles per hour, lost control over here. Now, it all started around 1 o'clock with a call to Sand Springs Police from the Walmart on State Highway 97 and Alexander Boulevard. Sand Springs Police told us that some people were trying to steal TVs from that Walmart, and when they showed up, they say those three suspects, a man and two women, were loading those TVs into their car. They drove off on, from police, jumped onto the highway, again, going 120 miles per hour. They lost control here, crashed just before the Quana Avenue exit. Now, Captain Todd Insbrenner told us that speeds like that put everyone in danger. He had no control over where it was going to go or what his fate was going to be. It was, it was just complete chaos. Both of the women and the men uh, and the man were taken to the hospital. Police told us that the two women were responsive, but that man was not. Again, like I said, TPD is working this uh, crash. I don't know how much longer they're going to be out here, but it is blocked off for a couple of hundred yards. Um, you can still get through here. It's just one lane blocked off, so it's not impacting traffic. Uh, we'll continue to stay out here and let you guys know when it's clear. Reporting live in West Tulsa, covering news that matters. Jenny Young, Fox 23 News.